good morning students so here i have brought very important part part 2 of textual exercises which is based on exercise 1.1 and 1.2 now this is very important please kindly pay attention here and one of the question is asked either uh, locate root 2 root 3 or root 4 in the number line or root 5 root 6 root 7 so we will have the both the practice now this is class 9 subject maths chapter 1 and parts 2 part 2 let's begin now the question is locate root 2 which is irrational number on the number line so what i have done is i have simply drawn one number line and here you might have observed that i have written one unit is equals to 3 cm so what you have to do is you have to use the 3 cm so i need to locate root 2 so you have to remember that root 2 will made up of 1 unit plus 1 unit so here 3 cm i have taken as 1 unit and the height also of 1 unit which is in the 3 cm so this is my original point or the initiation point o this is a now this is 3 cm but you will call this as a 1 unit okay i'll simply join this one unit with this this will be my b and i'll simply join o with b this is also one unit now you remember the pythagoras what we used to do this is now right angle so b b o square is equals to ab square plus A O square. Now A B is one unit, so one square. A O is one unit. Don't write three. We have already specified one unit is three centimeter. Now square of one is one. Square of one is one, which is two. So B O square is two. So B O is under root of two. So this is your under root two. Now what you will simply do is you will measure this distance, which is root two. use the protractor or the uh, use the compass which is of nice quality and just simply have one arc here now whenever this arc touch to your line now here mark point d and this is root 2 on the number line similarly you can go ahead with root 3 i'll just do one unit here okay and i'll join this okay now this is this is d now i'll put e here so root 2 square is 2 plus 1 square is 1 so 2 plus 1 is 3 so this is root 3 so accordingly you just measure this and just draw an arc on the number line with this radius keeping o as a center so this is here this is root 3 i'll mark as f okay i'll go ahead with root 4 so again i'll take one unit here as the height this is right angle this is right angle i'll join this to let's take this as a g now this will be root 4 and i will measure this the distance radius and from the o i will draw the arc now here this is root 4 and this point is h now root 4 already you know this is the 2 root 4 is 2 and this was one unit so this you got as two unit okay so likewise you can go ahead with root 5 root 6 root 7 now if they ask you before root 4 you can take start from one unit one unit but if they say that locate root 5 root 6 root 7 i'll give you the trick what you are supposed to do you directly start from two units because you have to locate root 5 so for locating root 5 you need root 4 and the height 1 so i will take two units here which is 6 cm but height always i will take the one unit which is 3 cm now one unit is up to you you can choose one unit as 2 cm 
2.5 सेंटीमीटर 3 सेंटीमीटर आई जनरली टेक 3 सेंटीमीटर सो फिगर इज नॉट सो स्मॉल और टू बिग नाउ दिस इज टू यूनिट एंड दिस इज वन यूनिट नाउ आई एल सिंपली जॉइन दिस टू ओके नाउ लेट्स परफॉर्म द पाइथागोरस अगेन सो वी कैन फाइंड आउट व्हाट इज द बी ओ विच इज द हाइपोटेनियस सो बी ओ स्क्वेयर इज ए बी स्क्वेयर प्लस ए ओ स्क्वेयर करेक्ट नाउ ए बी इज वन यूनिट सो वन स्क्वेयर एंड ए ओ आई हैव टेकन टू यूनिट विच इज टू स्क्वेयर सो वन स्क्वेयर इज वन टू स्क्वेयर इज फोर विच इज फाइव सो बी ओ स्क्वेयर इज फाइव सो बी ओ इज अंडर रूट ऑफ फाइव सो आई एल राइट रूट फाइव हेयर नाउ आई एल टेक द मेजर दिस आई एल टेक द रेडियस of ob measure keeping o as a center i will simply draw an arc on the number line so this number line where this arc touches that is my root 5 and i'll mark this as a d again i'll go ahead with this okay i'll join this two lines so easy it is and here i'll mark c this will be my root 6 If they ask you to show the calculation, you have to show the calculation. Here I am showing the calculation just for your understanding. So again, this will be root six. So root six, go ahead. Again, one unit. I'll join this two. So draw. the radius of of measure keeping o as a center this is not so steady you should use the protector which is steady so this will be root 7 so go on and on you can find root 8 root 9 so on and on so generally if in examination they ask you root before root 4 you should take one unit height and one unit base but if they asked more than root 4 which is root 5 root 6 root 7 this is root 7 okay so you will always take base as two units and height always one unit now this one unit you can use 2 cm 2.5 or 3 cm it's up to you so i hope you have understood how to locate roots on the number line this is very important kindly practice about this this is generally asked in the examination thank you